man, I'll tell you. I went on a run and a workout. For one time, the first time, this freaking little young white girl almost ran me over in the middle of a neighborhood, a family neighborhood. I don't know who gives these people licenses. My dad works for the NVA. You might want to take, watch who you give licenses to, man. I've been running, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. But who you are, what you look like, you're a runner, you're a walker, you're a civilian. You have the right of way. I'm on the side of the road doing my normal workout, and this freaking, first of all, she ran a stop sign. Well, yeah, she ran a stop sign. It's in a neighborhood. And then she, and she uh, like a stoplight, a stop sign, and she almost hit me, man. Like, she had to stop, and a guy saw it, an older gentleman, who was, and he's like, you should have took a picture. But I was just like, I looked at her, and I was like, man, just go. She was just, she stood there for a second, and I was looking at her. I wasn't going to keep running, because I wanted her to go first, because I don't trust her. I didn't trust her, man. This little girl, like, I don't know who, if she even had a license, if she was drunk, or if she was hungover. And I was like, just go, man. I just go like some fat white kid was in the shotgun seat i don't know where these kids come from but this is vera beach and this is a beautiful city my my family we grew up here i have a son. like yeah you're gonna hit me girl first of all you kill a 28 year old uh adult and you're gonna tell my kid you're gonna go to the funeral you're gonna tell my five-year-old son how he could his daddy couldn't be there he wasn't there for, alive for his birthday you're gonna tell my wife huh? I'm a beautiful wife you're gonna tell my family you're gonna tell all of them how you murdered someone and you and plus you get that's a felon that's a murder girl you're in jail for life or something like that just because you can't drive right and then and then I'm I continue my run the guy said you said took a picture I said it's all good just keep going just go I was like just go man just go I don't want to look at you like you're driving, you're you're driving. You have a freaking vehicle. First of all, it's a neighborhood, a beautiful Revere Beach family neighborhood. A church is right there. School's right there. You could have hit a kid. You could have hit. It doesn't matter. You could have hit someone. You could have murdered someone. It could have been anybody. That's a murder. Okay, and it's like I'm walking too. It's it's not like I'm out. I'm not a threat to anybody. I've never been a threat to anybody. I'm not like that's a murder. That's a murder. And that's not like a murder that is in self-defense or something like that, accident or whatever. That's that's not a murder. That's that's a whole different story. I went over that and one of my like the A1 Kane stuff, like self-defense and stuff. But that's just like murdering someone, if you would hit me or anybody else. In a peaceful, loving neighborhood. It's 9 a.m. on a Tuesday. Kids are going to school and whatnot. I'm doing my normal routine workout, just running, as all as humans do. It's Mother Nature. We're outside. And this freaking little white girl, doesn't matter what color, just almost hits me. Like, I made that, it's not funny. I made that one video about it, like a Towson, you know, how a car grazed me and ran past the red, the red light. And I was like, I just kept running because, you know, and she, I could have got her for a lawsuit. I don't know who, what, or what you're doing, but you're, you're driving a car. That's a weapon. It doesn't matter what, if it's a huge truck or if it has four wheels or two, it's a car. Are you going to tell my kids and my family and my wife, you're going to be there for the funeral, tell them how you murdered someone because you couldn't fucking drive? You're a fucking loser. Excuse my French. It's like I'm out here doing my normal routine. Uh, sometimes my wife runs with me. She, she, after that, she would have went home. I don't blame her. I'm, right now, I'm doing my cool down and stuff. And what if I had a kid it or a dog? It doesn't matter who or what you are. Or an old man, like a riding a bike. It could have been anybody. I, tell, I do this for a reason. Now I'm putting this up. It's a neighborhood, first of all. It's not even like the city or anything. Which still isn't an excuse. There's no excuses. And that's right when I put a video up saying safety first. Anyway, it's all good. I actually did a holy matrimony and elopement later on after that workout. So after something bad happened, it's all good. And my, these girls call me up. My old friend from high school. What's up? You know who you are, beautiful, bonita. I uh, hope you you got my songs. You know, it was good to talk to you. And the holy of matrimony and elopement was beautiful. You know, that was uh, 47 and then the 48, 47. And then we had the three, which is the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, angels. So that's 144, so that's a 50-50. And then I plus one it with a 48 to make it. And that was 11-11. And today is April 26th. Happy early birthday. Uh, perfect, 222 for the summer. Korean Prince will be the loca. I saved it, of course. Um, even if I didn't, everything's sacred. So, I do, by the way. You do as well, I heard. Uh, absolutely, forever and ever, and always until the end of time. Be careful driving out there, guys. All right, and then later, and then after that, like about an hour or so, 
Well, after later on my run, I was in the running again, like down there, or whatever. This is Vera Beach, passing here. And then this old guy who's driving a truck, a white guy, doesn't matter the color, just saying, Esau and stuff. I don't know who get, fire them all. Like he's driving like a big truck with a porta potty on the back. First of all, you have a porta potty and a big truck, and he's speeding in the neighborhood. And all these, there's construction workers right there. You could run one of them over. They're doing road work. And you could run over anybody. He's speeding, and I, I was like, slow. I told him, slow down, man. And he looked at me, and he listened. He said, slow down. I don't like to use my voice, but I got to. God gave us a voice for a reason. I'm a. It's like, what are you doing? You're dr is he drunk or hungover? What is it? You're in a rush, bud? It's, it's 9 o'clock a.m. Go ahead. Relax. What are you speeding for? You have a porta potty, first of all, and a big truck, and you're speeding through the neighborhood. Are you trying to be cool? Like, what is, what is it? I don't get it, man. I really don't. I just wanted to make that video about that. This little one. It's friendly and fantastic as usual. So, stay cool. I'm going to finish my stretch and cool down. Not being negative, man. I'm just being straight up. Everybody should be. Mothers and fathers came to marriages. You do this. Do the same. You do the same, right? I mean, come on now. Shit. And the ladies. We're getting the water guns. I'm getting the, the big one up in the sky. You know? I don't know who you think you are. Get over yourself. It's whoever. There's not too a lot of people out there. I hear trumpets from Baltimore. I hear you, bro. Right, I gotta go to work soon. They're telling me, let me know. Love you all. Be a local, all right? Caribbean prince. It's out of love, right? Israel De Jacob David. Not here. All right, see ya.